Hello everyone, today I'm making a nice cottage pie. I'm not using um, beef mince, I'm using turkey mince. You can use chicken mince or any mince you like. So what I have here is some water, cold water. Teaspoon of salt. And this is a kilo and a half of a, a potato that I've cut into each one into eight and this is gonna boil until it gets soft and then I'm gonna add some butter and some cheddar cheese grated cheddar cheese to it and just mash it and then after that I'm gonna make my mince mixture you can say it's a fricadelle mixture that you're just gonna bake with mashed potato on top that's cottage pie here in this house so we'll be right back Okay guys, I'm going to start the fricadelle mix. I've got a kilogram of turkey mince. Like I said, you can use any mince you like. I've got one large egg. I've got two teaspoons of freshly ground pepper. You can use white pepper, ground black pepper. This is a um, salt to taste. This is about a teaspoon and a half. You can use parsley, but I only had uh, coriander, dania. So this is the dania, uh, three to four cloves of garlic, grated or chopped, one medium onion, finely chopped. I had some peppers, so a little bit of uh, yellow and red peppers, and I just chopped it up. It's about half a cup's worth. And then I got, you can use three to four slices of bread soaked in water, then you squeeze out the water. I only had three slices, so that's fine. And you just put all this together. If you want, you can add chili, fresh chili or crushed chili. You can add some ground cumin, whatever you like, okay? Make it yours. Okay, I'm going to put everything together now. There we go. Everything in. And the sun is out today. It's a beautiful day in Cape Town. Um, the bread, the egg. You can go way finer with this. You can put it in a food process if you like. The pepper and the salt. Now with clean hands, you just mix everything together. Can you lick a sim? Okay. And we're doing liquor laundry, washing. The washing is early in the line. Gonna do some bedding as well. Wash some bedding. So this is a very basic recipe. Okay. So I'm not evenly distribute all the ingredients. There we go. I don't also want to overwork it and it's a crumbly. In stiff. Okay. This is a three liter capacity um, oven dish. I'm just going to put this in here. And remember, this will shrink as it cooks. Press it down. Potatoes are almost soft. And I'm going to mash it and show you what I just throw in. Mm. 
Okay, we'll be right back. Guys, I'm just going to make the mash. This is about 100 grams of butter. I just use a whisk. But you can use a masher. <laughs> Throw a little nutmeg in if you like on the top. I think I'm going to do that. You can make it as smooth or as chunky as you like. Okay. One second, and if you like, you can add like a couple of tablespoons of milk. I'm gonna add just some cheddar cheese. I'm just going to mix this through. Go. Okay. Oh, just get this on my neck. Here's my neck. I'm going to grate some over. One second, guys. Okay, and my oven is preheating on 180 degrees Celsius. Okay. Put my potato on. Nandikaku. Some nutmeg. If you don't have nutmeg, it's fine. Eh? You don't have to, and not too much because it's quite strong. Okay, so this is going into the oven for about thirty-five minutes. And then we'll be right back. Okay, guys, um, I've just made a quick salad. This is a favorite. Um, I use pears, the ripe and ready pears. It's sweet. Some red peppers if you have. And just the four-leaf um, 
four leaf lettuce and I use the this one reduced Greek uh, dressing oil reduced oil Greek dressing <laughs> you know Shelly when you just laugh at yourself <laughs> yes yeah. <laughs> and when we serve the food then I'm going to add from the dressing yeah, very simple but so delicious. And I'm letting the cottage pie go another five minutes and then we'll be right back. Okay guys, the cottage pie is out of the oven. It's going to settle down and we're going to serve it of course with a salad. There's some strawberries and uh, what else? I was gonna make millies <laughs> but I thought no guys I think I'm gonna end of the video right here there we go look at that yummy in my tummy and a nice salad looky looky <laughs> yeah hey, yeah yeah this is gonna be good no, Shelly, it's going to be real good. Mmm. There we go. Okay, guys, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. <laughs> You're the, the usual. And I um, hope you enjoyed this video. It's a, a nice, easy dish for, um, for the family, to make for the family. And, um, you know, leftovers you can always keep in the fridge. The next day, what we used to do with our cottage pie, Shelley, we used to put it um, for work or for school on the butter bread. <laughs> <laughs> it was delicious. Anyways, there we go, guys. And I'll be back again with another video soon. Bye, everyone. Shelley, say bye, pretty means. Bye. <laughs> okay, bye.